So today I want to show you how to use the curve calculator feature in Civil 3D under this drop down menu. And what we're trying to find out is we're trying to figure out some additional elements to make sure that we're vetting the information before we put it into our alignment in here. So the first thing you do is you pull this down. Uh, the first one you leave alone unless you're using railroad uh, definitions or any other way. We're just doing conventional circular. You change this fixed property from delta to radius. Next thing you do, remember everything's in decimal degrees. So in this case, we're going to take the decimal value of 9 degrees, 25 minutes. And I've already pre-worked that out. And you can download the old HP apps uh, that they have on the phone or if you have a calculator. Uh, the next thing you do is you change it from radius back to delta and that kind of locks it in. So the next value we're going to put is the tangent value of 117. Point five eight, excuse me, nine eight, and we'll hit enter, and then it's going to come with all these values. So we'll double check the arc distance of two fifty three forty three, and we line up within a hundred. So the radius of that is fourteen thirty two forty six.